Hey guys, this is Ivan with Overlook DNT, and in today's video, we're working on a tileable block swapper. Bam! All right, so this is a build by uh, Miss Mandy with an I. Ah, get out of my way! Uh, and basically, I mean, it's what I could think that it was called. All right, don't look to the left, kids. Don't look to the left. Sausage is a bastard. Um. And uh, yeah, so I mean, this is what I took it at. I took it as a uh, a block swapper of sorts. Uh, you know, here I use it for lighting. It can be. Uh, crafting table anything that can be pushed by pistons pretty much is what you're able to use it for uh, it is restricted by the push limit on pistons so what is that 12 so you're able to do like multiple layers see comes back and then they hide away I don't know what to call it maybe hideaway swapper I don't know no I'm gonna stick with that I'm gonna stick with what I had all right so I'm gonna just make this one too wide and then I'll kind of explain how you're able to just kind of add the rest of the parts so <clears throat> we'll just go like that Redstone torch, redstone torch, block, block, redstone torch, redstone torch, block, block, uh, redstone torch, redstone torch, uh, block, block, and uh, redstone torch, redstone torch. Alright, so if you're going to make something along these lines where it's a bit, uh, you know, larger, here I'll use a lever. Just make sure that the sticky pistons that are going to push and retract these blocks are on the unlit torch as this machine is off. Okay, you see that? Unlit, 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 and the last one also unlit. Yeah, that's pretty much the uh, gist of it. Uh, so right here, this one's going to be sticky piston, unlit, unlit. Uh, right here is where a normal set of pistons going to go that pushes them up. And then we have to have the ones that push them down. So, repeater, repeater. We'll go up. Uh, another block like so and the normal piston and normal piston and then that's pretty much it so <clears throat> these are the blocks that are gonna get pushed out nah nah and we need one gap like a spacing of one pretty much so as long as uh, the power passes through here activates this one and then goes up the tower uh, all the timings don't have to be adjusted it's pretty much good to go so you can wire this up to pressure plate or what have you. Alright, so I have the wrong one that would protrude. So we want this one to poke out. Like that. And so it would be hidden at this point. You know, this is your floor level. And then we hit it. And then they come out. And they go back in. And obviously, again, it's not extremely flush or anything along those lines. So it's just a matter of hiding the system itself. Like that. So see, that's potential to make something cool, some kind of uh, storage room or something along those lines. And again, if you do want to make it larger in the sense of height, then just attach the sticky pistons to the not lit, uh, the unlit torches. And then, you know, the final one also unlit. Awesome, guys. Well, uh, big thanks to Mandy with an eye. I hope you guys liked the video. As always, subscribe up top and peace out.